Hello Honda friends. So this is my old alternator, right? Uh, I started cleaning it, but you can see there's still cakes -y. cakes of uh, That was actually axle grease because my fucking boot came undone when I was uh, playing with it and When I put it back on I didn't realize that an excessive amount of grease was everywhere including on the outside of the boot so as I drove it flung grease onto the alternator and then when the car would get hot the alternator light, I mean the battery light would start to flicker on and off and I looked up that overheating could be a cause of that and I'm assuming that's because it was literally caked in grease and probably frying like a goddamn pork chop. So there's that. But I did end up buying a new one. So I'm going to show you a magic trick that will solve many of your issues because I watched many videos on this and everybody said how tricky it was to get out. It is not. Now the hardest part about this is going to be trying to show you with one hand because this thing is a tad bit heavy. But so I moved the power steering line, did not take this, I did take this bracket off, but it was unnecessary so I put it back on there. And you're gonna see why. Fuel line, I had also taken that off, unnecessary, wasted my fucking time. I've seen people unscrew the, um, the master, master brake cylinder, complete waste of time. None of that's necessary. You don't have to disconnect any fucking thing except what's connected to the alternator. And I'm gonna show you why. Come on, grip strength. If you go back here, right? All the way towards the back of the intake, the fucking thing just slides right in there. Would you look at that? Nothing, nothing was moved. So when you change your alternator, remember that annoying guy that always asks a lot of questions will sometimes throw you a bone. Have a great day, guys.